of Ventura, it's Ashley with your weekly crime and safety update. On behalf of the Ventura Police Department, we wish you a very happy new year. Let's make it a safe one by being aware of crime prevention information so that you and your property are protected. Let's take a look at Ventura's weekly property crime stats. I'm Officer Sean Portillo with the Ventura Police Department. I've been on patrol for approximately four and a half years. And these are your weekly crime stats. In the past seven days in the city of Ventura, we had two residential burglaries, seven vehicle burglaries, 15 thefts from unlocked vehicles, and one stolen vehicle. We also had two reported package thefts. It's important that you give us a call at the Ventura Police Department's 24-7 non-emergency number to report anything suspicious. The number is 805-650-8010. It's also important to file a report if you've been a victim of a crime. You can do so on our website, VenturaPD.org, by giving us a call or by visiting our department during business hours. Thefts from vehicles also lead to other crimes, like identity theft when a wallet or checkbook is stolen. These crimes can be easily prevented just by simply removing items of value and making sure your vehicle is secure. Remember, take it, hide it, lock it, or lose it. Protecting property this season also means being aware of the forecast. Rain is expected this month. The city of Ventura encourages residents to prepare for rain. In the aftermath of the Thomas fire, the potential for flooding, debris flows, and erosion is greatly increased. Homeowners should consult an erosion control professional for assistance. More information can be found at VenturaCountyRecovers.org. Free sand and sandbags are available for City of Ventura residents while supplies last at the City of Ventura San Jone Maintenance Yard, located at 336 San Jone Road in the public parking lot. Residents are asked to bring their own shovel. Please check VCEmergency.com for incident information, including road closures and evacuations when an event like excessive raining occurs. Local children will be heading back to school on Monday, January 8th, so we urge extra caution. Please remember that motorists are required by law to stop for school buses that are stopped and operating flashing red lights with or without a stop sign displayed. This includes motorists who are approaching the stopped bus from behind and or approaching the bus from the front. Please follow the posted speed limits to help keep our community safe. Residents are encouraged to register with VC Alert at vcalert.org to receive emergency notifications. Please also consider joining nextdoor.com to stay connected. Nextdoor is a private social network for you, your neighbors, and our community. We have over 20,000 Ventura residents using the platform. It's an easy way for you and your neighbors to talk online about issues of concern and also a place to receive information from the city of Ventura. It's not just for crime and safety. Residents also post information about things like lost pets, garage sales, and questions about services in our area. To sign up, simply go to nextdoor.com. Thank you for your time. We hope this information is helpful in protecting you and your property. Please let us know if there is information you would like to hear about. We would be happy to feature specific topics. Give us a call with your request at 805-339-4317. See you next week. Stay safe, Ventura.